we will now show you how easy it is to program letters for the CNC 90 controller. We'll start by entering text by draw text. We can enter a text. This is an example for the CNC 90 controller. We will select a Verdana. We can select any font which is, al is available in your windows. So in this case we'll select Verdana and we'll select a height of let's say 45 mil. Uh, we'll select the bold and we'll click on OK. View all and you will see the text appearing. This time it is just a text. By selecting the text we can convert this into lines and arcs by using the vectorized text option. We'll click on it and we can enter an accuracy of the profiles. We'll enter 0.1 mil and we'll click on OK and you will see that all letters are being converted into lines and arcs. We will now ent insert an NC window by moving to the menu CNC90 insert NC window and you will see the NC window appearing. We'll define the start lines of the program by entering a length of your sheet. Width is for example 500, the thickness is 18. Our reference point will be on the left top so we'll enter 2. The comment is letters and we will click on OK you will see the first NC lines appearing. By selecting, for example, these letters, you can move the letters around to any position you desire. Let's say for this case we'll move them to this position. By selecting all the letters again, we can then define an approach on each profile. By clicking here we can select uh, the diameter of the tool is 4, adjust approach. In this case we will enter yes just to show you which options you have for your approach and we'll click on OK. You can see you have six different options. In this case we'll just select the simple one and enter 5 and to depart the profile as well as just being a straight line. OK. We can then uh, define the length of the line in comparison with the diameter of the tool. We'll all select one which means the length of the line will be the same as the diameter of the tool. OK. We can then choose on which side we want our approach. In this case on the left side so we'll machine the profile on the outer side and we'll click OK. On each profile profile we will now have an approach just by showing you this you can see this. On this point it will enter and on that point it will depart the profile. We can now convert this into NC code by moving to convert to NC code. We will enter a tool number of the tool on your machine, probably an Alberti. The depth of the machining will be 4 mil and we'll select a step of 4. The feet will be 2. Name of the profile will be NC and we'll click on OK. And we can select uh, a left correction, right correction, tool side compensation or no compensation. In this case we'll just select the zero and we'll click on OK. And Tensor will now convert all the profile to NC code. Beware that if you have some uh, more complex profiles, if you use the tool compensation 
you must be sure that you will not have small arcs which are smaller than the, uh, the diameter of the tool. In that case you might get an error on your machine. If you still want to do this with tool composition, think about offsetting all these levels before you define the approach and convert it into NC code. On the left side you see the NC program by toggling with your uh, arrow button on your keyboard you can walk through the NC program and you will see the arrow in the drawing field which represents the NC line. By moving back to the drawing field we can move to end lines. You can see you have different options to program your CNC and ID controller drilling jobs are also possible sawing and we will now enter the end lines and you will see your program is complete to get your program on your CNC 90 controller you will have to move to convert to CNC 90 you can enter a number of your program let's say 1 in this case and we'll have to click on control V which is paste just to save some time typing the full name and it will automatically then be copied to your disk. Save. I want to replace it. Yes. And it is now being converted. And this means now that you can take out your disk out of your PC and insert it to your CNC controller after which you machine this program. For more information about TensorCAD CAM, please check out YouTube and take a visit to our website and if you have any more questions just send us an email also about the pricing of the program which is quite attractive you will find out that so far this example